Hello YouTube, Jedimon2005 here with a review of the Kamen Rider Wizard Capsule uh, Ring Set 6. Um, you'll see it's, it's kind of small. Uh, what we're doing is small. Uh, these are the four uh, Rider Rings that are included in this set. Uh, you'll also notice something different. Uh, this review, and I don't know, uh, probably everything after this, at least for a little bit, or maybe a little bit, uh, you got a different bit of a background here, right? Uh, this is uh, at my new house. If you've watched my vlogs, uh, you'll know that I, I just recently got a house. I'm in the process of moving still, actually, as of recording this. Um, and I don't yet have a desk. Uh, and the TV trays are back at my parents' house and stuff. And all those books you, you used to see are actually on a bookshelf, uh, as they should be. Uh, so it might look something like this for the time being, uh, so feedback is always helpful. Uh, this is basically the kitchen <laughs> table, the dining room table, uh, was what you're seeing um, until I get a desk and then I'll be in, a, you know, uh, in the spare bedroom. So that, explaining that out the way, uh, let's take a look at the pamphlet. I just opened it for whatever godforsaken reason. Uh, so here it is, and we can see Beast here, Kamen Rider Mayonnaise, if you will, uh, with his uh, focus. Oh, nice. There we go. Okay, so we see uh, Wizard Ring uh, 06. Uh, that's the capsule. We got Beast. We got the comes with uh, the Beast Ring that comes with, but the set includes, I should say, the Beast Ring, uh, the Falco, Falco, Buffa, Camelio, Dulfi. Um, and then it's got two ability rings. Gravity. Dress up. Um, and then we've got our four rider rings. So what we have is Kiva Basha, right, which I happen to personally like. I think the green eyes look really cool. Uh, dog, Kiva Dogabaki, which uh, if you saw Kiva, uh, it's basically all four of his main forms uh, combined into one set of powers, right? Dogabaki. So Doga Basha. Oh, no, so Dog Gururu, uh, Basha, and Kiba. Uh, then Kick Hopper, uh, Punch Hopper is in a different set. Uh, and then we have Shadow Moon. Uh, so Shadow Moon, though not a rider uh, officially, he does get his own ring, which is pretty cool. Um, and you'll see it's just going to say Dark Rider, which again is an oxymoron, I guess, which doesn't make much sense. So let's get started. Here is. Uh, the Kiva Basher ring. I mean, that's just a really pretty green. I, I really like it a lot. Uh, so you can see the standard Kiva face. Uh, I believe we saw uh, Emperor already um, in another set. So here's Basha, right? Uh, standard with a uh, rider ring design. You can see the fangs in there. It looks pretty, pretty neat, I think, uh, personally. Uh, next is, let's, let's tilt, you know, curve in the wall. Dogabaki. Um, Again, nice. Um, it's the standard um, yellow eyes that Kiva has. Is his Kiva form has? I'm not as big a fan of the yellow, just because I'm not a big fan of that color in general. But um, you know, it's there. It's it still looks nice. Same face. The only, the only difference between this one and Basha, uh, like I said, the different color eyes. So next up is Kick Hopper. Uh, you can tell it's Kick Hopper because it's the red eyes. Also, if you can read the pamphlet and can read the kana, that tells you his name. But, you know, the red eyes signify Kick Hopper. Punch Hoppers, I think, are like a yellowy color or something like that. <clears throat> I have to actually look at Punch Hopper to tell. But I know they're, they're a different color. And um, so, pretty nice. You can see the, the grasshopper look, the horns, uh, the mouth uh, flaps or whatever. To, you know, man, his, his insect mandibles. Uh, Alright, so we have that, and then last but certainly not least is uh, the thing everyone goes crazy for, Shadow Moon. Right, everyone loves Shadow Moon. Uh, he's got the green eyes, got the antenna, as we see here, you got the, the mouth, right, looking pretty menacing, pretty menacing mouth. Uh, so, you know, all of them, uh, I, didn't, I didn't show the backs of all of them, but they all have oops, the standard uh, gray, like this, you know, on the back, and whatnot. So. Uh, those are our four rings. Uh, let's go ahead and get the wizard driver in here. Now, you know, 
The rings we didn't get is because we already got them a different way. They all work the same. There's no, um, you know, nothing special there. And now because these are rider rings, they will work with the belt facing either direction. And we will start an order with Basha form. Look at that. Kiba. So we, we do have that, you know, the Kiva transformation. And now Doug Abaki should do the same thing. And that's pretty neat, you know, uh, Doug Abaki. Uh, the, 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 the yellow eyes, I should say, do look pretty good um, lit up like that. All right, so next up is going to be Kick Hopper. Right, 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 right. So you know, if you if you, if you saw Kabuto, you know you know this really wasn't the friendliest of guys uh, to our our main hero uh, and such. And now finally, we're gonna have Shadow Moon. Okay, so he has, he has his own sound. I forgot. So you'll notice the difference in those two is Shadow Moon actually says his own name. I forgot he did that, actually, because I haven't used, it, um, used the rings in a while. Um, so he will say Shadow Moon, which is actually really cool to me because, you know, things like Kick Hopper and Punch Hopper, um, I forget what other Dark Riders um, they had. I think Eternal. We had Eternal. Uh, I remember him. Um, you know, some of those ones... They don't say their name. They just say Dark Rider, like Kick Hopper does, um, and presumably Punch Hopper does. Uh, but Shadow Moon has its own sound, which I think is cool. You know, so if you like, uh, you know, Kiva, you got two forms of Kiva in this set. You have uh, Kick Hopper and you have Shadow Moon Plus. You can get all four of Beast Mantles and the Beast Ring without buying, you know. Um, the, the ring holder without buying the dice saber or even without buying his belt though why you would get it if you didn't have the belt I really don't know I mean I guess you could see it on the wizard driver um, and then also um, you know these two if you didn't get their particular ring sets um, you can get them here so it is beneficial uh, to look into the set you know if it's if it's something you want to skip on maybe on some of the more expensive role play toys and whatnot so uh, until next time Check out the podcast, Riders, Rangers, and Rambles, uh, dot com. Apparently that, that will take you now to our, our podcast, uh, like it's supposed to. Uh, bringing you the latest Toku news in the craziest way possible. Uh, thumbs up, comment, subscribe. Uh, do leave, you know, feedback about uh, the look. I do happen to like the nice wood look. It, it's a little better than the, the blue, um, you know, and, and the nice uh, backdrop over there with the, the wall coloring. It's a, it's a different look. Um, so, uh, you know, like I said, until next time, uh, we'll do that stuff. So, uh, whenever the next review is, because I'm waiting on stuff. So, uh, I'll see you guys then. Bye.